Hey guys, welcome to Easy Learning Economics. I'm Dr. Carval. In the previous lecture, we learned in detail about consumption and saving function. Here, we are going to determine the level of national income using consumption function where saving is zero. So, given consumption function is C is equal to 100 plus 0.8 Y. This is the autonomous consumption and it is the marginal propensity to consume. By using this consumption function, we have to determine the level of income where saving is zero. Consumption function is equal to A plus B Y. P is equals to consumption plus saving. If we say saving is zero, it means the income is equals to consumption. So we solve for income where saving is zero by plugging the consumption function for C. When income is equal to consumption, now we substitute the consumption function for C after solving it that the income is equals to 500. You can see here that the income is 500 when the saving is zero. Why? Because that the income and consumptions are equal. It means when the level of income is 500 million dollar, the saving is zero and the income is equals to consumption. We do cross checking here that when the level of national income is 500 million dollars, the saving zero or not. Given consumption function is 100 plus 0.8 y. So, by plugging the value of income that we have found that 500 million dollars. So, the consumption, the total consumption is 500. So, it is proved that income is equals to consumption and savings are zero. I hope this will be helpful for you. Thanks for watching.